about just coming into the off season. You say that you wanted to come back, not to be here. Just how's your off season been, and what's your impression of the new team that's been formed here? Uh, it's been busy, uh, busy off season. You know, I was rehabbing basically the whole summer from my left foot surgery. I did that uh, at the end of May, so. Yeah, but you know I'm fully recovered now, so yeah, put a ton of work in, and uh, I'm really happy about the you know all the rehab process and uh, all the work we've been putting in. And uh, yeah, as I said, busy summer, uh, new contract. I just had a newborn baby, so <laughs> yeah, it was, it was a lot, but uh, I'm definitely happy with all the stuff I was able to experience and. Uh, and coming back here, uh, I wish I could be, I could have been here a little bit earlier. But you know, having a newborn at the beginning of August, it took a little bit of time to to get all the paperwork, visas, all the stuff. So uh, we just got here like a week ago, and uh, all I've seen is like great vibe, uh, a lot of new faces, but a lot of enthusiasm. I think that's what we kind of needed uh, from last year, and uh, it's like a fresh start. So. It's, uh, it's it's great to be back, and, uh, and I can't wait to start tomorrow. Hey, the type of player you are, big, shooter, can attack closeouts, that's very, very valuable in today's NBA, and all the great teams have a player like that. How much pride do you take in being that type of player? Uh, a lot of pride, I think, you know. it's. Uh, for me, it's just the, the the basketball I grew up with. You know, uh, I always been playing like that. I never never really liked to be um, characterized. I don't know if that's that a word. Yeah. <laughs> uh, as a, only a shooter, uh, that was my role at the beginning when I first got to the NBA, and I was kind of fighting that. But uh, I'm really glad and happy that uh, I was able to come here to the Pistons last year in February. So I was able to showcase a little bit of more. What I do, what I can do on the court, and uh, yeah. But for me, it's just you know, make the easy play, make the right play every time. If you if you got a shooter, I shoot it. If I got a tactical to close out, make the right pass, I'll do it. On that new year, new coaching staff. What are those early conversations like with JB about what your role is going to be with the team? Uh, we haven't really spoke about that. You know, I was I came here in July when I when I signed my contract, and they were just, were just settling in. You know, we just had a. A uh, small talk for a little bit, and uh, you know, I'm just, I'm just happy to to get to know him, get to know all the new coaching staff, and uh, as I told him, I'm I'm ready to 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 do whatever he needs me to do. Like I'm ready to help. I'm ready to give my 100% to the team. If it's that, like uh, being a vet, being you know helpful for with the young guys, uh, provide my experience, uh, give everything I have on the court as I always do, then uh, you know. Every time I'll be I'll be asked for it, I'll, I'll do it. When were you able to get back on the court after the surgery? And how, how did you feel now? Uh, I was able to get back to fully like uh, five on five, like after three months. So that would be end of August. So it's been like a, a month that I've been playing like five on five, and uh, feels good. You know, I feel fully fully recovered. The uh, the surgery went well, so I'm really happy about it. On the topic of coaching, uh, you worked with Federico Gallinari this yeah. past summer. What's your relationship been like with him? Uh, it's been great. I, I didn't really know me, know him before. Um, you know, he's the brother of Danilo, which I know a, li a little bit more, of course, uh, because I play with him in the national team. And uh, I was really happy. You know, I was speaking with Trajan the whole summer, and you know, they were really happy to send someone to work me out in Italy. So they sent him. They sent Fede and. Uh, Chris Hart as a strength and conditioning coach. They were helping me out for like a week or so, and uh, it was great. You know, uh, being able to have them there back in Italy, my my hometown Pescara was was kind of fun, and we had a really a really good week, week of work. Absolutely, absolutely. I always said that, but I think it's it's the same feeling for everybody, you know. Uh, playing playing with K does just just make your life a little bit easier, you know. And uh, uh, I can't wait to start playing with him again. And all these new guys we have, you know, we we had some veterans, which is always good, you know. Uh, I know Malik because we played together in Utah and. Uh, yeah, it's a great guy to play to play along with. Uh, I always play against Tobias, which 
always gave me a hard time, you know, when I was guarding him. So I'm really happy to 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 play with him this year. I think you only played 13 games when you got here after the trade deadline yeah. last season. But like 16, yeah. Like 16. What did you? <laughs> <laughs> 16. <laughs> My bad, Excuse yeah. me. Um, I'm messing with you. <laughs> Just what was your impression of your own play, uh, you know, just from those two months, and what do you hope to build on coming into this season? Uh, it was, you know, such a shame that I could only play just just those those games because I got hurt after that. Uh, but I was happy to to give my contribution and to see uh, what kind of role they were giving me. You know, I was a little bit more important than I was in Utah, and uh, I have a little bit more opportunities to showcase my talent. You know, I have a little bit more the ball in my hands on offense. Um, I was really happy about it. They they just really show me how much they they, they wanted me uh, when they trade for me. So being that like wanted from a friend Embraer franchise is not that, you know, uh, I don't take it for granted. So I always be thankful for the Pistons to the Pistons organization to make that happen and uh, of course they, with the with the new contract we, we had this summer I'm really thankful for that too. I don't know if that answered to your question, but <laughs> kind of. Good. Thank you, guys.